Sarah Chang has been on the road for two decades and she's not even 30. A classical violinist with the life of a rock star, hooked to the performing circuit. Every night is different. Amazingly enough, after all this time, um, being in a different hall and just the energy that you get from being on stage, it can be quite addictive. So, yeah, it's still a lot of fun. There is a certain amount of pressure, but it's more the pressure that I put on myself for wanting to give a better performance today than I did yesterday. And tomorrow always has to be better than today. Those who work with Sarah Chang say she's easygoing, fun and great on stage. Sarah is one of these incredible forces of nature. She never loses the, the sense of drama and the theatrical element of this and, um, and of the music, most importantly. Um, so it's inspiring to work with her. Sarah started playing the violin at three and performed with the New York Philharmonics at eight. For some, she's the quintessential child prodigy. It's okay to be eight years old and then called a prodigy. It's kind of expected, but then when you're 18 and the label still follows you and then you're 28 and it's still there, um, you, you sort of realize that it's a label that's never going to quite peel away. Yet her musical maturity is way ahead of her years. At her great performer's debut at the Barbican, she played César Franck Sonata, which she says sums up a life. After a whole lifetime of experience and turbulence and emotions going up and down, at the very end, you're at peace with yourself and you reflect on the beautiful moments of your life. And I think that's why the fourth moment is my favorite. And with youth and talent on her side, Sarah Chang has a lifetime of beautiful musical moments ahead of her.